want to win in business, you need to think differently. That's where design thinking comes in. It's about understanding your customers, really getting inside their heads. What do they need? What do they want? Design thinking is a process, a way to solve problems creatively. It's about empathy, about putting yourself in your customers' shoes. Observe their behavior, talk to them, understand their pain points. Once you understand your customer, you can start brainstorming solutions. Think outside the box. Don't be afraid to experiment. The beauty of design thinking is that it's iterative. You try something, you learn, you improve. This approach isn't just for designers. It's for entrepreneurs, marketers, CEOs, everyone. It's about understanding human needs and creating solutions that resonate. So, are you ready to unlock your creative potential and build a business that truly connects with your audience? Let's get started. Leadership isn't a title, it's action. It's about inspiring others to be their best, to achieve a shared vision. In these first 10 days, we're going deep on leadership fundamentals. Start with yourself. Define your core values. What do you stand for? What's your leadership style? Understanding your strengths and weaknesses is crucial for growth. Next, focus on communication. Clear, concise and compelling. Your team needs to understand your vision, your passion. Your energy is contagious. Bring it every single day. Remember, leadership is about empowerment, not micromanagement. Trust your team. Delegate effectively. Give them the tools and support they need to thrive. Celebrate their wins. Learn from their setbacks. Together, you'll achieve greatness. Sales, the lifeblood of any business. It's not about being pushy. It's about understanding your customers' needs and providing solutions. These 10 days are about mastering the art of the sale. First, become a master storyteller. People buy stories, not just products. Craft a compelling narrative around your brand and your offering. Connect with your audience on an emotional level. Next, build relationships. Networking is key. Attend industry events. Connect with potential customers online. Provide value up front. Share your expertise. Build trust before you even mention your product. Remember, listening is crucial. Understand your customers' pain points. Ask questions. Tailor your pitch to their specific needs. Be authentic. Be passionate. And most importantly, believe in what you're selling. Section four, spread the word, marketing mastery for business growth, days 21 to 30. Marketing is everything. It's how you reach your audience, build your brand and drive sales. In these 10 days, we'll dive into the fundamentals of effective marketing. First, define your target audience. Who are you trying to reach? What are their interests and needs? Once you know your audience, you can tailor your message and choose the right channels. Content is king. Create valuable, engaging content that resonates with your audience. Blog posts, videos, social media updates. The possibilities are endless. Be consistent, be authentic and provide real value. Don't forget about data. Track your results. Analyze what's working and what's not. Marketing is an iterative process. Continuously test, learn and optimize your campaigns for maximum impact. Section five, from vision to reality, executing with precision, days 31 to 40. Ideas are worthless without execution. In this next phase, we're all about turning your vision into a reality. It's time to roll up your sleeves and get things done. Start by breaking down your goals into smaller, manageable tasks. This makes the process less daunting and more achievable. Prioritize ruthlessly. Focus on the tasks that will have the biggest impact. Embrace agility. The business world is constantly changing. Be prepared to adapt and pivot when necessary. Don't be afraid to experiment and learn from your mistakes. Remember, execution is a team effort. Communicate clearly with your team. Delegate effectively. Provide support and encouragement. Celebrate your wins along the way. Section six, orchestrating success essential management principles, days 41 to 50. Management is about getting things done through others. It's about building a high-performing team and creating a culture of success. In these 10 days, we'll explore key management principles. Communication is key. Be transparent with your team. Share information openly, encourage feedback, and create an environment where everyone feels heard. Delegate effectively. Identify your team members' strengths and assign tasks accordingly. Empower your team to make decisions and take ownership of their work. Provide regular feedback. Recognize and reward good performance. Offer constructive criticism when needed. Help your team members grow and develop their skills. Section seven, 
Time mastery, unleashing your productivity potential, days 51 to 60. Time is your most valuable asset. In these final 10 days, we'll focus on maximizing your productivity and achieving peak performance. Start by identifying your peak productivity hours. When are you most alert and focused? Schedule your most important tasks during those times. Minimize distractions. Turn off notifications. Create a dedicated workspace. Learn to say no to unnecessary commitments. Take breaks. It may seem counterintuitive, but regular breaks can actually boost your productivity. Step away from your work, clear your head, and come back refreshed.